Hey everyone, Theo here, back again with another book review. Today we are taking a look at Spotlight on Nature, Tips and Techniques on Drawing and Painting Nature on Location. This is just one of the many books from the Urban Sketching Handbook series, which you can see I have many. So each book actually talks about a specific subject matter. So this one is on nature. This book has 112 pages and it's available in this paperback format. The authors are Virginia Hine and Gail Wong, both very experienced urban sketchers and teachers. This is a wonderful book for those who love urban sketching, sketching, sketches, sketchbooks, and also for those who have problem drawing and painting nature. So in this book, you are going to see a lot of tips and techniques, not just from the authors, but also from contributing artists from around the world. So we have very lovely examples, uh, very beautiful sketches. And one thing I really like about this book and other books from the Urban Sketching Handbook series is you can see how different artists approach the same subject matter using their own style. So when it comes to painting nature, you can use pen and ink, you can use color pencils, you can use watercolor, you can use black and white. There are many different ways you can, many different techniques that you can use to draw and paint nature and you can see many of the examples in this book. All the contributed artworks are credited. So if you want to, you can check out more art from the contributing artists. The sketches are really lovely. So this is a very inspiring book. And this is a book that you can flip through once in a while just to get inspired, just to get ideas. This sketch is actually more like a painting. I don't see any line art. This was painted by Gary Gareth with gouache. And this was painted with watercolor. And that's a pen, ink and watercolor sketch by Don Lowe. There are many tips in the book and many different places and types of nature featured. This is actually not a book that's going to teach you how to draw step by step. It's just a collection of tips and techniques. However, um, I believe beginners and intermediate artists um, both will be able to enjoy the book. There are also examples of nature in the city. So it's not just nature in rural areas, but also in urban uh, setting. I like the variety of artworks uh, featured. These are really nice. Some examples on how you can use colors and color theory. Wow, um, very nice. Some tips on how you can use texture. The thing about the books from the Urban Sketching Handbook series is if you buy one, you will feel like you need to buy like all the books and I'm not sure which uh, what's this book number this is probably book 18 or 16 uh, I can't really remember there are just way too many books in this series so the last few pages are actually uh, just gallery pages this one is by Maru Godas, painted with gouache and colored pencil. Uh, this one is by Inma Serrano. Very playful sketch. I love the style here. And these are the contributors um, with their websites listed and a list of checklist, a checklist with uh, different challenges that you can challenge yourself with. Official retail price for this book is 20 US dollars or 15 sterling pounds. You can probably find this book at a lower price on Amazon and Book Depository. The affiliate links are in the video description below. 
This is a wonderful book and I can recommend this very easily as well as all the other books from the Urban Sketching Handbook series. Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. Bye.